Hey guys, it's Mudster here, and uh, today I'm making another video for my uh, Raspberry Pi I got, guys. And as you can see, of course, I got a Raspberry Pi, if y'all seen in my other videos. Uh, I have a couple other ones, if y'all want to go see, go check out my channel. But uh, today, uh, I got a keyboard for it, because I was using these two, like, uh, non-wireless keyboards, etc. But these are t this is a wireless keyboard. Plus, it ha it's supposed to have a mouse pad on it, so hopefully that will, or mouse touchpad, so hopefully that will work really well with the uh, Raspberry Pi. So, uh, guys, uh, this would be an unboxing, and uh, let's get to it. So, first thing to unbox, I need my bag of knives. So, which one do I want to use? Ooh, this is a good one. I Gurkha Company. This is my knife as y'all can see okay, get out Speck it up. so uh, let's get into it sorry for the poor quality of video uh, not the best at it but hey you know do what you gotta do get up here see here I get that and get this side always cut away from your sails you ever use a knife? <laughs> Alright, come on now. There we go. Should just slide right out. There we go. Sweet. So here's uh, this package. Get something out of the way. I don't care about it. This is a special keyboard, you know? Ooh, here's the keyboard, bro. Sorry guys, uh, I'm back. I had to go talk to my mom real quick, but uh, as y'all can see, it comes with your instruction book, and go this thing we'd love to hear from you. And... Oh cool, three dollars off from any uh, Zeta Guard purchase. Uh, I am definitely gonna use that before y'all. Oh, I don't know how though. <sighs> well, I'll find out. Oh. Ah, you see that promo code? Y'all can't use that because I'll have it done. Uh, as you can see, it looks like it comes with a charger for it. So, that's cool. And then you have the keyboard. And uh, this is a very small wireless keyboard. A lot smaller than I thought, but I think it'd be good for it. Sorry, guys, for that. Going. I think this would be good though for a Raspberry Pi. So I can see it's very. Hey guys, I'm back. Uh, sorry, uh, my uh, pretty much my camera ran out of battery, and I didn't notice that. So uh, let's do this before it runs out again. <laughs> but uh, as y'all can see, I have the keyboard here, and it's a little charged up, and I have it connected to uh, my Raspberry Pi. And uh, as you can see, it comes with a dongle, of course, and this awesome charging cord. And what's cool about this cord is that the you have you plug this into you know your computer, but you got another end for anything else. So you can plug your phone up, charge it. You can do many things. So it actually gives you another port back, or since it's wireless, you can plug up to anything USB, you know, whatever. But as so you can see, this keyboard is a very small keyboard, but it is very good. Let me unplug this real quick. It is a very nice keyboard for it. Just a simple, you know, going on the Raspberry Pi. As y'all can see, where is my mouse? If I can find it. There it is. As y'all can see, you know, it moves perfectly around. And then you got your left and right to click. So, you know, you can click on that. Boom. And then typing is very nice. It's good for the keyboard. It's very small, which is nice. So it's very portable, but typing is very good. I like it. But this is a very, it's a cheap keyboard. The one problem I found, guys, is like, you know how you can, here, I got my other computer out. On here, I got my uh, Corsair mouse, is you can go, and drag, make a blue box. Well, look, I don't know if this will do it. I don't know if this is not supposed to, but it kind of starts to glitch out. So anything you have to click and drag, so I'm going to show you, it kind of freaks out. So anything you got to click and drag does not work. 
but it is very good for the price because I don't think I'm going to do much like editing and stuff. I'm going to, you know, have fun, maybe uh, play games or something. I don't know. But uh, I'll pop up a game here real quick. I'll pop up Minecraft. Let's see how it goes. Oh, here. Ooh, it's very slow. I gotta pump up that uh, sensitivity, but for Minecraft, see if I can put it down. I hope y'all can still see it. All I can see is a very nice keyboard. It is a little small, so I have big hands, so it's a perp, but it can get a little cramp, but for just simple things, maybe I might do some coding or etc. Just stuff for the Raspberry Pi, it's very good. So uh, guys, I really hope you, oh, and I'll put the uh, link in the description for this down in the description. And if y'all want Raspberry Pi, I'll put that too. But uh, uh, if y'all enjoy the video, uh, please give it a thumbs up and uh, please uh, subscribe for more content. I hopefully will have more cool Raspberry Pis. I've been thinking about making Matrix, LED Matrix, and a lot more cool projects. But uh, if you do enjoy it, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more. Bye-bye.